What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough, the 2022-2023 edition, possibly, maybe, I do not know. I am on a roll with the recording and all that stuff. Anywho, so, we made a bit of a trip to, uh, what was it called, uh, to Pallet Town, and it turns out it's quite the same. Professor Oak promised us a little something something if we managed to get all 16 badges So that's exactly what we're gonna be doing right here in this episode. We're gonna be getting not one but two gym badges Yes, let's do this Alrighty as always I am going to be speed running this whole thing because Well, yeah, there's there, 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 there are a lot of trainers right here, and I uh, don't think you guys want to see the the trainer battles, you want to go to the important stuff, so we're going to be doing that. And, uh, well, let's go with Chico right here. Let's do this right here. So, anywho, again, I've been having a lot of fun with uh, the walkthrough right here. I'm actually very, very proud of the way everything went, or is going right now. I don't know, past tense, future, future tense, and all that stuff. Um, many of you guys... Uh, many of you guys have left some pretty darn good compliments onto the channel right here. A lot of you guys are starting to come into my channel and, uh, you know, saying a lot of kind things like, you know, highly underrated and all that stuff. It's nice. Thank you guys for all the support. That's all I can say. I mean, I do, I do this as a hobby. And I do strive to make these walkthroughs a little bit better than what the originals were. Uh, for those who are new coming in... This is, is, this is like the fourth time that I've done this. Um, not really the fourth time, but the third time. And obviously, I'm not much of a... Well, I'm, a, I'm a, a bit of a perfectionist when it comes to this kind of stuff. Because, well, I really, 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 really like to make these walkthroughs uh, as good as the other uh, YouTubers out there. One being uh, Luroy, who was an inspiration for me starting up a channel, and the other one, Light Dark Neutral, and, uh, well, yeah, shout out to Light Dark Neutral if you're watching this. Pretty sure you are, homeboy. And, uh, yeah, I just want to make these games a little bit better than what I did them before and all that stuff. And, again, the next game we're going to be starting off, or we're going to be going off of, is Pokemon Emerald. I cannot wait to get to that one because, well, it's a lot of meaning behind the, the next walkthrough right here. So, here we are in Cinnabar Island. Now, there is a little something something right here. The volcano apparently erupted. There's a notice. Cinnabar Gym has been relocated to the Seafoam Islands. Blaine. Okay. And there has been a nasty volcano that really did something. And, uh, well, there is a somebody right there that we've noticed. And apparently there might be some hidden item right here. Yes, we found a rare candy. Thank you, Jeebus. Okay. So before we do anything, let's go right ahead and talk to this individual. He looks a little familiar. Who are you? Well, it's plain to see that you're a trainer. My name is Blue. I was once the champion, although it only it was only for a short time. <laughs> or like five minutes. That meddling red did me in. Anyway, what do you want? Do you want to challenge me or something? I hate to say it, but I'm not in the mood for battle right now. Take a good look around you. A volcano erupts, and just like that, a whole t a whole town disappears. We can go on with uh, we can go on winning and losing in Pokemon, but if nature so much as twitches, we can lose in a second. That's the way it is. But anyway, I'm still a trainer. If I see a strong opponent, it makes me want to battle. If you want to battle me, come to the Viridian Gym. I'll take you on then. And just like that, he disappears. Flipping you off, Gary. I'm flipping you off, Red. Okay, so we're going to be healing up our Pokemon. And, yes, we are going to be using some... Uh, we're going to be using some Pokemon in here. For this in uh, this uh, initial battle and all that stuff. Alrighty, so, let's see. Let's talk to this guy right here. It's been a year since the volcano erupted. Oh, really? And uh, Cinnabar Gyms apparently lives uh, alone in the Seafoam Islands cave. So, let's see. We're going to be going up against Blaine. He is a fire-type gym leader. I think it's appropriate to use some Pokemon that can actually help in this situation. Let's go ahead and... Oh, wait. Actually, let's bring back Hera because there is an item that we need on that. Yeah. Alrighty, so Hera, come on back. 
Alright, so before we do anything, guys, I'm actually gonna switch up a few things. I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys, so here we are back, and well, guess what? We are uh, bringing in some, uh, some heavy ar artillery right here. As you guys can see, we brought back Lucky just for this occasion, and well, we brought, uh, we brought in our friend Tank. Yes, we did use him at some point, and it does have some pretty good moves that can actually help us right here. So, let's go right ahead and start destroying everybody. Alright, and yeah, we're not gonna use Chico. I don't know why I have him right there, but... Alright, let's go right ahead. Let's get it. And, uh, let's see, what else is there? Oh yeah, let's go right ahead and use a Max Repel, because we don't need, we don't need any of that mess right there. There will be some trainers, so let's go right ahead and bring back uh, Chico again, I guess. That way it can get to level 60. I did give it the rare candy that I found around here. So that way it can get to level 60 and it can become easier for me to, like, train my Pokemon up in the Pokemon League. And, well, here we go. Bring it. And we're gonna be doing uh, this the fast way because we don't want to really... We don't want to drag on and all that stuff. Like I said, this episode will be two Pokemon battles each. Or two uh, Pokemon uh, gym battles right here. And, well, there's really nobody here. As you guys can see, there's one cave open, but the other one has been locked away forever. And ever and ever and ever. Yeah. And ever. Okay. So, something messed up right here, too, guys, is the fact that, well, once you go into the... Once you go into the uh, the cave, you're gonna be a little bit disappointed right here. So let's go right ahead. Look at that. That's it. That is it. That is the only thing you can find here in this location. Okay. So let's go right ahead and talk to Blaine. Ha! My gym and Cinnabar burned down. My fire-breathing Pokemon and I are homeless because of the volcano. Ha! But I'm back in business as a gym leader here in this cave. If you can beat me, I'll give you a badge. Ha! Huh, you better bring a burn heal. Okay! Alrighty, here we go. I love the song. Gym battle number seven, or 15! Yeah, can't even count, guys. Sorry about that, can't count. So, here we go. Macargo versus, well, Lucky. Let's go with a little Surf right here, since we are the faster of the two Pokemon. And just like that, that's right, Macargo defeated. Lucky, you are getting a redemption story like nobody's business. That is right, you're gonna get into like at least level 42 or so. And he's coming out with a Magmar, so I guess... <laughs> I guess we're just gonna go with Lucky, holy crap, and he is using Sunny Day. Oh, baskets. Okay. There we go. That's gonna weaken our attack, or yeah, it's gonna weaken our water type attack a little bit. But luckily for us, we do have a ground type attack. And that takes half its HP. Let's go with Earthquake. And, well, because it decreases our attack, it will increase his. And, well, here comes the Earthquake attack. Let's go, Lucky. That's right. The redemption story continues right here. I, I, I want to say channel 26, 24, I don't know. And bam, level 41, Lucky. Oh my god, Lucky, you are being lucky. And here he comes out with a Rapidash. Alright, bring it on. Let's get it. Rapidash is looking for fast and flamey. So, let's go right ahead and use Earthquake Attack. And here comes its patented bluff, uh, what would you call it? A Fire Blast Attack right here. And... Oh my god, that almost takes me out right there. So here it comes, guys. Earthquake attack for the win. And... Oh no, mama no! Okay, okay, so it, 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 of course, you know, Blaine is going to heal his Pokemon right there. And, well, we got to do this one last time. Earthquake, come on, finish it. Critical hit, critical hit, finish it, and yes! Lucky wins. Fatality. That's right, Lucky is being lucky. That's right. So, awesome, I burnt out. You've earned the Volcano Badge. Lucky you, you are lucky, look at that. 
So there you go, guys. We earned our 15th badge right here. I did lose this time, but I'm going to win the next time. When I rebuild my Cinnabar gym, we'll have to have a rematch. And, well, after defeating this guy, well, <laughs> the only guy that's ever believed in you is like, Yo! Huh? It's already over? Sorry, sorry. Cinnabar gym was gone, so I didn't know where to find you. But hey, you're plenty strong to even know uh, without my advice. I knew you'd win. Did you? Did you really? Okay, so... I don't think I... Yeah, I didn't bring Togepi with me, so... Uh, there was probably no reason for me to bring these other Pokemon. Um... You know what? Screw it. We're gonna go right here. We're gonna be battling some more. Uh, talking a little bit more before we go into the next gym battle. Lucky you did your thing. And uh, let's go straight to Chico right here. So after defeating the gym leader, this actually opens up. And, well, we're going to go straight to Fuchsia City just so you guys can see that, you know, everything has been changed afterwards. And there we go. Defeated it. Yeah. All right, Lori, you have been defeated. All right, bring it on. Uh, actually, we need to use a repel. I just realized something. There we go. There we go. And... Let's move on ahead and start battling everybody. So, and there we go. Razor Leaf attack for the win. Lapras coming out. She is coming out with some big dogs right here. And, and yes, Chico, come on. There we go. Chico is nearly at level 60. So, the next big battle is against Gary or, you know, uh, Blue from Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow. And... He is no slouch when it comes to battling and all that stuff. Cannot wait to start battling him. I mean, it is an easy battle, or it is an, e it is an easy way to go at him when it comes to, you know, different stuff. He doesn't have a, a special, like, he doesn't have a single elemental Pokemon. He has a nice variety of, te of, of team members. So you guys gotta have a make, you guys gotta make sure that your team is nice and leveled up for this guy right here. Have him at level 50 or so. But then when it comes to red, yeah, you better keep your eyes peeled for that mother sucker right there. And, well, here we got one more person. Here we go. Here we go again. And we're going to continue going with the body slam. Yes, getting some levels. There we go. That's how you feel. And that is how you do it. Okay. Alrighty. So, if you guys remember... We were here in Route 19 to Fuchsia City, and I think these guys are done. These guys are done cleaning up this whole place right here. Look at this. He's like, I'm all sweaty. Time for a swim. And what does this guy have to say? The road work is finally finished. Now I can go fishing again. Alrighty. Okay. So, what we're going to do is we're going to be moving on forward to Viridian City. So, I'm going to get my Pokemon, fly out there, and then after that, just... Finish it off right there, so I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys, so here we are back in Viridian City where it all began. And yes, we have 15 badges in all. Now it is finally time for us to go for our, fi our 16th and final gym badge right here in the gym or in the Kanto region. And I kind of figured going along, going back from Fuchsia City and all that stuff, um, yeah, I kind of figured that. If we're going to be battling Blue, we might as well battle Blue the way we knew how. Yo, champ in the making. How is it going? Or how is it going? Looks like you're on a roll. The gym leader is a guy who battled the champion three years ago. He's no pushover. Give it everything you got. I will. Don't worry. I got you. So, like I was saying, guys, let's go ahead and give uh, good old Blue here a little PTSD right here. You'll see what I mean. Yo, finally got here, huh? I wasn't in the in the mood at Cinnabar, but now I'm ready to battle you. You're telling me you conquered all the gyms in Johto? <laughs> Johto's gyms must be pretty weak, pathetic then. Hey, don't worry about it. I'll know if you're good or not by battling you right now. Ready? Ready, Johto champ? Bring it. Okay, so it looks like to me, it is going to be a battle, uh... Kind of like in Pokemon Yellow, so bring it on. He's going to be coming out with his Pidgeot right here. And, well, what a better way to start than uh, Aaliyah. Let's go. Bam. So right off the bat, he comes out with a Pokemon that's been 
you know, kind of torturing us for the greater part of Pokemon Yellow. And this guy survives. So here comes a mirror move and, well, look at that. Using the same move as us. Okay. And, wow. Okay, so it is a... Uh... Oh my god. <laughs> oh, my niece is pissed at me. Okay, Terramon, let's go. All right. I know how to do this. Roll out attack. And just like that, Pidgeot has been defeated. And if you guys have noticed on my team, we're going back to the Pokemon Yellow team. Yes, Pokemon Yellow team going up against this guy right here. And let's see who he's coming out with. Executor. All right, I know who, who to come out with. Let's go, Godzilla. Let's go. There we go. Let's get it. Bring it. There it is. Flamethrower for the win. This guy is definitely getting some shit right here because, well, he's like, wait, this team is familiar. This guy's getting familiar. Like, he, this is familiar. Like, we battled these Pokemon before, and just like that, Executor has been defeated. Alrighty. Look at that. Okay, so our team is coming back, and, well, let's see. He's coming out with a ride on. Let's go with Torpedo. So Torpedo is coming back with his original team now as a Kingdra. Oh my god. Let's go, Torpedo. Bring it. So here we go. Surf attack for the win. And... Just like that. Right on. Come on. Go down. Just get finished. Just get finished. There you go. There you go. Alrighty. Okay. Alrighty. So, let's see what's next. He's coming out with a Gyarados, and, well, yeah, my Pokemon got defeated real quickly. So, let's go right ahead and go with Sir Razor right here. Alrighty. Bring it. Okay. Gyarados, how's it going? It's been a while. Let's go with a Sleep Powder. He's coming with a Rain Dance. Rap Baskets. I could have used a Thunder Attack on him. And that does not affect this guy, so let's go ahead and... Oh, doesn't work. There we go. Sleep Powder for the win! You are now to s you are now asleep, my friend. Okay, so... Do I have a revive? Please tell me I have, like, a full revive or something, and it looks like I don't have it. Crap baskets, okay. <sighs> I am going- I am going to enjoy what I'm going to do with this guy. Alrighty. Let's go, Ultra Psycho. Bring it. That's right. And here comes a full restore. And yes, he... <laughs> okay, let's go with a psychic attack. Alrighty. Look at that. Let's go. Go down. Finish. Oh, crap, baskets. Okay, here comes a hyper beam. This guy is coming at me pretty hard. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stay, 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 stay. God dang it. So that's what happens when you have only two revives. All right, Terramon, let's do it. This is a this is a bit of a risk, obviously, but it is a risk because you know it is a ground and rock type Pokemon. But because there was an opening right there, this will actually help me. And he's using a full restore, so we are powered up just a tad bit more. All right, roll out attack times two. That's right, time to feel the full force of Terramon right here. And... Yes! Critical hit. Look at that. Yes, he's definitely feeling it right now. He's like, oh man, I remember this guy. Alright, who's next? Alakazam. Alrighty. Alakazam, how's it going? It's been a while. Time to take this rollout, and he's using a Reflect right here. Okay, so here we go, rollout again. Times three. And... Oh, it survives! Will it survive number four? Let us find out. Right here on Telemundo. And... There we go. Times four, it will not survive. That's right. So we got one more turn. I'm thinking of risking it right here. I really am. So he's going to be coming out with his Arcanine. Let's go right ahead and finish it off with this guy. Of course, he's going to take the first... Uh, well... Well, he's going to take times five right here. So there it is, guys. Times five. Arcanine. Feel the Kaoken. 
Critical hit. Fatality. Oh, yeah. And would you look at that. <laughs> oh, my God. What? How the heck did I lose to you? <laughs> All right. Here, take this. It's an Earth Badge. And yes, throwing out the peace sign, guys. We have defeated this guy with our old team. That's right. How does it feel to fail? All right. I was wrong. You're the real deal. You're a good trainer. But I'm going to beat you someday. Don't you forget it. Flipping you off, Gary. I'm flipping you off. Okay. All righty, guys. So that is all 16 badges. All of them. Let's go right ahead and uh, pick up our little, uh, well, pick up our, our, our little prize from Professor Oak. So, after getting 16 badges, guys, you need to go straight to Professor Oak right here and talk to him. And he's going to be like, wow, that's excellent. You collected all the gym badges in Kanto. Well done. I was right in your assessment of you, or in the assessment of you. Tell you what, Draven, I'll make arrangements so you can go to Mount Silver. Mount Silver is a big mountain that is home to many wild Pokemon. It's too dangerous for your average trainer, so it's off limits. We can make an exception in your case, Draven. Go up into the Indigo Plateau, and you can reach Mount Silver from there. And yes, my Pokedex is going well. I do not want to... Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to... I, I really don't care, okay? So there it is, guys. 16 badges in all. Yes. Okay. So, in all honesty, guys, we have three episodes left. Three. And believe it or not, we're going to finish off at episode 69. <laughs> this is 69, and if you guys want to check out something funny, I have left the link right there on the description for 69. It's nothing bad, it's just a fellow YouTuber going crazy on the 69 for Pokemon Crystal. Shout out to you, Leroy. Wherever you are, man, hope you're all well. Anywho, so we got three episodes left. In the next two, we're going to be going up against two legendary bird Pokemon. We're going to be doing some stuff. And from there, we're going to be going up against Red himself. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be quite... It's going to be quite a, a, a... Well, it's going to be quite an adventure going up against Red. So, I thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys again for, you know, subscribing and all that stuff, for following this walkthrough. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Crystal walkthrough. See you guys.